you want a mug for the camera? Hey everybody, this is Matt and we're at Texas Toast Guitars and to my left, your right, is my buddy Trevor and he's here to help me tell you guys about a really cool thing that we, well we've actually been doing it for quite a while but not very many people know about it. Um, but first, I have two, I have, I have two questions for you followed by a series of questions for you. Okay. All right. Would you like a piece of, uh, of caffeinated aviators chocolate? Yes. You, okay. And, uh, and then after that, are you ready for the uh, 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 lightning round of, of questions? Oh, yes. Okay. All right. Now, some of these may or may not apply to you. All right. Are you ready, sir? I am ready. Okay. Okay. Um, uh, Coke or Pepsi? Coke. Ice cream, vanilla or chocolate? Chocolate. Coffee or tea? Coffee. Guitar you always wanted to build but never have? Uh, Les Paul. Cats or dogs? Dogs. Favorite movie? 1984. Go-to car for everyday driving? Forerunner. Uh, guitar you've had the most fun building? This one. Um, how do you like your steak? This doesn't apply to you. Yeah. Uh, no. Football or baseball? Uh, baseball. Uh, Facebook or Instagram? Instagram. Hardest guitar you've ever built? Uh, the fabric top. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. Good. So, um, 38 seconds. Not too shabby. What do you think of the uh, uh, caffeinated uh, chocolate? It's really good. We're it's gonna, tasty. Yeah. Let's see if I can sleep tonight. Oh, I think you'll be fine. Yeah. I, I think it, they, I, they said it was. They've been making this since the 30s. I it's guess, really so. good. Yeah. You want some more? No. I'm okay. Good. All right. Okay. So, anyway. So, um. Trevor is uh, participating in, a, I guess you would just call this the, the challenger level of Patreon membership, right? Mm -hmm. So, um, as you guys know, if you spend $100 uh, on Patreon or with Patreon, um, uh, you can put that towards the uh, purchase price of a guitar. And what Trevor did was he signed up for the challenger level where 100 bucks a month and uh, you've been paying it off, and we figured it out that you're, you basically paid off a Challenger Level 2 Maple Top. And so what we did was he said, I took some time off. I'm ready to come in. Well, let's get, let's get, your, uh, get your guitar. So tell us what, you, what you've done here and, what, and, and what's been going on. So, so far, I've been able to sand out the top, um, route out the pickups, um, do clean up the neck. Wow. We fit we fit the neck. Fit the neck. Oh, and we fit where the bridge goes mm -hmm. as well. Fit the bridge. Did the roundovers. Lots of sanding. Always lots of sanding. Mm -hmm. um, and then Th this is this is a particularly oh, jack hole. Uh, that's right jack hole. This is a particularly cool thing because this is the only way people often say, "Hey, when are you going to do a build your own challenger workshop?" Well, we're not. Um, but what we are doing is this. So, so you took off like a, like Monday. You came in. Yep. Uh, today's Friday. You came in, and we did some more stuff. We basically got it finished. So, and while you were doing that, I did a bunch of stuff too. So this isn't one of the things that I did, but but basically, we did we did a half a dozen Challenger level ones and twos. You did one, and I did five. Mm -hmm. um, so. Like like he was saying, we, we got the uh, we got the next fit, we got the the bridge fit, we got the top sanded, we got pickups install or pickups routed, um, round over, uh, lots and lots of sanding, and we drilled for the uh, for the jack. But this one is um, uh, so you could do this with a Challenger level two, like Trevor did. You could do a level one, um, and it'd be the same thing basically. So it's all the same stuff that I do. Um, when I when I'm working on challenger level ones and twos, but you get to you get to come along and, and do some of it. And you at no point were you ever like, eh, I don't know. I, I it was all pretty easy stuff, right? Yeah, absolutely. Especially having done a workshop before and yeah. even had I not, it's still you know, you're right there in the exact same way as in the workshops. Mm -hmm. Um and I get to see you work building a guitar, yeah. building Every, for every one thing I do, you do five. Well, I've done it time. one other yeah. time before, though, so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so um, so on, no, you're going to come in on Monday, right? Mm -hmm. Yep. And so what we'll do on Monday is we'll get frets uh, pressed in. And then lots and lots of sanding and glue up. And then what we'll probably do is we'll 
hand you over to Chris, and you guys will do some some finish work. What what so? You, well, I just let's show it again because this yeah. is a great looking guitar. It's a yeah. maple maple top level two. It's absolutely beautiful, and this maple top. It, they talk about in the videos how thick the maple top on uh -huh. these Challenger level. Like it, that's it's chunky. a substantial piece. Yeah. yeah. And it's beautiful maple, and the neck is absolutely incredible as well. So, and you went with P90s because P90s. you don't have a P90 guitar? Yep, and I am excited to have P90s, so yep, okay. it's going to be P90s. What color do you think you're going to do with uh, on this one? So the plan is to do that kind of translucent, really cool yellow that you guys have been mm -hmm. doing. What do they call that, Chris? Uh, vintage Amber. I, 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 but here's what I was expecting to say, that translucent, really cool yellow. He didn't do it, I thought, I thought. No. And then, we like, won't, uh, We won't show this part. Right. <laughs> uh, uh, dark orange burst on the edges, and then I've got a stencil um, that I'm hoping to do over top of it that blends from the, the uh, orange up. Okay. So. Yeah, man, I think this is a cool thing, and I, don't, I, I think that people kind of know about it, but don't really know. Um, so I have a question for you, another question for you, Trevor. What if um, what if people don't live locally and can't can't come in? Yeah, I mean it's it's definitely easier for me because I live locally. But I mean I'm sure they could schedule it. You're building challengers all the time. Well, or you could just say, hey, I think I'm close. Uh, I want I want my uh, so like this one here. This is a Patreon guitar, and uh, we're doing this one for Mike. And um, you know he's like either getting close or he's already paid it off, and and so. Here it is. It just needs to be, you know, final assembled and everything. But so you don't have to come in to um, to do this. But if you want, you can. If you want to come in for part of it, you can. If you want to come in for none of it, you don't have to come in for any. Or if you want to come in for all of it, you can too. So when you came in on Monday, we did some stuff, and then you you um, uh, you called it a day, and then you came in uh, like on Friday that same week. I hadn't done anything to your guitar, so you've yep. done everything that I do to these, well, maybe a handful of exceptions. I think there was one or two times I'm like, do you mind if I just do this? So, um, yeah. But like you use the pin router, you use the, 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 all the sanders, the drills, um, the, all, all kinds of good stuff. So yeah. it, it, it's, a, it's a cool thing. And I, I'm like, you're the first guy who's come in, because like I said, you know, Mike's guitar is here. But you're the first guy who's come in and been like, hey, I'm here to let's build a Challenger. I'm like, cool, this will be fun. And, and it is fun. I've, I've been having a great time hanging out with you and, and making this cool guitar. And it's a neat way for, I don't know, if, if you guys, if it's, it's another way to get a Challenger, right? Yeah. So um, there's lots of ways that you can, uh, you can do this. You can just buy one of our guitars. You can, um, uh, you can finance it. You can pay it all off at once. You can custom order one, you can buy one that we have already in inventory, or you can do like Trevor did, and you can sign up on Patreon, the link in the description below, and it's, I think it's called the Challenger Membership, and it's 100 bucks a month, and when you get to the level of whatever guitar you're making, you pay that off, boom, we, we start your guitar, or you come in, and, and, and you can make it too. So what's been, uh, what's been a cool thing that you, what's, what's been the most fun part, Trevor? Kind of just getting to hang out and yeah. do the woodworking and watch you do the woodworking and talk with you and Chris and kind of just hanging out. Plus, yeah, you got the inside scoop on a couple of things that we've been working on that like no one, no one else knows about. So yeah, you're you're in the uh, you're on the inside track. Um, was anything uh, or at any point where you're like, man, nah, I don't know, I don't, know. I don't want to do it. No, no, okay. I well, and I again having done a workshop before, I I was mentally prepared for what we would be doing and it, you just I mean just like in the workshops you're there you're supportive got all my fingers make yeah. sure everything is safe um and make sure everything goes well and and nothing gets messed up so and one of the things that you and I were talking about was we're all jigged up to make this guitar so it's mm -hmm. like it goes on one jig and then it comes off of that and it goes on the other one and on the other one etc so we're all you know what I mean? If we had to start from scratch, obviously we wouldn't be able to build these guitars in two days. But and of course these came from uh, came to us uh, direct from Steve at uh, Maximum Guitar Works, who helps us with bodies and necks. So there, there, uh, there's a lot of the woodwork is is already done. But this is a cool way for you guys to uh, get your own Challenger and kind of get hands on too, if you want, or if you just want to take a long time to pay it off, you can do it that way too. So, uh, is there anything else that we missed, Chris? 
Okay, no. Chris, is, Chris is going like this. So, um, uh, Trevor, thanks for hanging out with us. We'll see you Monday. Yep. Okay, Super Bowl Monday, Re Recovery Monday. And uh, so this is Matt from Texas Toast reminding you that uh, life is short. You might as well have a cool guitar. And if you're cool like Trevor, you'll come in and help me build it. You got anything? You got you got your tagline? No, nothing good. Okay, all right. All right. Thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you next time. Have a great week. Don't play my guitar,